So welcome, my name is Johan Falk, I live in Stockholm, Sweden, and I'm going to create a few videos to show how to use uh, Google Drive and Google Spreadsheets and Google Scripting to do some stuff with uh, board gaming, simulating stuff uh, useful for board games. If you haven't used uh, Google Drive yet, this is a good time to start. You uh, create an account at Google, go to drive.google.com, and somewhere there you can hit the New button and create a new spreadsheet. Spreadsheet in uh, Google is like Excel sheets, uh, but they are online, so you can access them from any computer you like as long as you have logged in. I'm going to call this one uh, um, uh, Coding Examples 1. And we're going to mainly work, well, 98% of the time we will be working in, in scripts and coding stuff. But you also have here a spreadsheet, which will be very useful from time to time, because we can import data here from some other spreadsheets. And we can also export data from uh, from code we write to this um, to the spreadsheet, so we can uh, continue working with it with other tools. So uh, the a secret stuff that we want to be using is found under extensions nowadays. It was <clears throat> previously found under tools, as Google, Google notifies me about, but now it's under extensions and app scripts. This is the secret rabbit hole where we will be stuck for some time now. When you click there, you get a coding environment. And here we can see a number of stuff uh, and things. I'm no, no expert in using all of this. I will show you some things, but I can't show you ev everything because I don't know everything. Uh, but here is a name of a file where, where we have our code. You can create new files and rename files. And here is our code. <clears throat> we can, let's see, just to see what we can do very, very briefly, I'm going to create a function which will not be called my function, but uh, roll a die. I can name it anything I like. It has some parentheses and stuff around it. And here I can do, uh, well, write code. This is JavaScript uh, with some extra libraries added. Google Script uses JavaScript uh, as a language. And I'm going to uh, create a variable here called called result result equals and then I'm going to uh, return build a value random value between one and six and return it for rolling a die and how to write this is uh, something you have to learn using JavaScript Google stuff uh, read tutorials and just experiment but you will be using let's hear math dot random this will create a random number between 0 and 1. Take that times 6, and we have something between 0 and 6, not including 6, uh, so strictly less than 6. Uh, add 1, so we have now you know, something between 1 and, well, from 1 to less than 7. And then I'm going to round this down, math dot floor round this down and then i'm gonna return the result so this function when called i'm gonna save here Control s is good for, good for saving as well when this function is run you can click here actually running this function it creates a uh, a random number between one and six and returns it <clears throat> And this took some time, first time, but next time much, much quicker, as you see. Um, we don't see this see this number. Uh, we could let's actually start by doing that, because you will be debugging a lot. If I type here debugger, you can see I get suggestions for what to type. Just hit enter, save. And now if I hit the debug button, uh, I'm going to debug this function get some uh, panel here to say saying that we have one variable here it's called result and it has a value two and then run and it's ended run again and it's value one stop run again 
value one, stop, run again, value six, nice, stop. If I run this, not using the debug function, but just running, it will skip all the debugger statements. <clears throat> okay, so what can I do with this? This is a starting point for doing a lot of fun things, but we're gonna start simple. In the spreadsheet, I can call this function, uh, typing equals, roll a die, parenthesis, go. Now it runs the script and gives us uh, two. I can copy, add this to a number of, of cells if I wanted to, and I have uh, die results. Now this isn't really extraordinary because there are already functions for returning random numbers you can use straight up in, in the spreadsheet. But it's a start and it shows that when you write functions in the, in the JavaScript code, you can call them from the spreadsheet, which is great. And I think that's where we start for now. Uh, in the next video, we're gonna see how to use these uh, functions a bit more and, and call them, uh, call, make calls between functions and stuff like that. See you in the next video, bye.